The automobile industry's focus is clear as we move forward as their business is becoming more environmentally friendly. And we see luxury automakers continuously developing new all-electric vehicles. You no longer have to pick between convenience, speed, and sustainability. With the best luxury electric automobiles, you can now have it all. So sit back, relax, and join us as we explain all about the top three most luxurious electric cars ever made. And whenever anyone talks about luxury cars, the first name that pops out is none other than Rolls-Royce. So let's start with Rolls-Royce's all-electric Spectre Coupe, which is taking its ultimate luxury ethos to a new realm. While the Spectre Coupe shares the same architecture as the Phantom Sedan and the Kulinan SUV, it is powered by an electric powertrain comprised of two electric motors producing a combined 577 horsepower. The Spectre is the first in a series of EVs from Rolls-Royce and the company believes that its gasoline-powered vehicles will be phased out and replaced entirely by electric vehicles in 2030. When it comes to power and performance, all Spectres will be equipped with a dual-motor electric powertrain producing 577 horsepower and 664 pounds-per-feet of torque. According to Rolls-Royce, this is enough to propel the 6,559-pound coup to 60 miles per hour in 4.4 seconds. You could scoff at that estimate, pointing to the Tesla Model S Plaid which touched 60 miles per hour in 2.1 seconds in our tests. But, but Rolls-Royce's brand image is more about calm cruising than mind-bending acceleration. Rolls-Royce has installed adaptive suspension to provide a properly isolated ride, and the engineers have also found the place for large amount of sound-deadening material, which Rolls claims will keep the cabin whisper silent. Rolls-Royce has yet to reveal the size of the Spectre's battery, although it's expected to have a driving range of approximately 260 miles per charge. DC fast charging should be doable, but we expect most Spectre customers to have a charging system installed in their estates so they don't have to wait at Walmart parking lots like the rest of us. And now comes the most interesting and luxurious part, which is about its interior and comfort. So the cabin of this Rolls-Royce Spectre accommodates four people, with bucket seats in both rows. Anyone familiar with Rolls-Royce's current interior design would recognize a similarly opulent one here. However, the brand has incorporated numerous design elements that are exclusive to the Spectre. The Spectre's door panels, for example, have a similar glitter to the brand's iconic Starry Night headliner, with small LED lights sparkling and the space surrounding the armrests. We don't yet have all the details or a list of options and features, but the Spectre should be available with an almost limitless number of customization and material possibilities. Now, we hope all of this has risen your hopes high for a Rolls-Royce Spectre. Now let's move on to our second luxurious EV, which is Lucid Air. As several firms have launched EVs in an attempt to disrupt the transportation business, the 2023 Lucid Air luxury vehicle is one of the few that has made a significant impact thus far. Its large battery and compact motors, both designed in-house, enable it to give unrivaled range and performance. The Grand Touring Performance variant can accelerate 0 to 60 in 2.6 seconds, and it can cruise for 516 miles with its estimated driving range. And that's enough range to get from Boston to Baltimore while still having electrons to spare. More importantly, it has more range than any other EV on the market today. The new Sapphire variant is considerably faster, with a stated timing of fewer than 2.0 seconds to 60 miles per hour. The Air's attractive design and large cabin add to its appeal, but the price tag had us expecting plusher materials on the inside. Almost all of the car's controls are controlled via one of the several displays scattered throughout the cabin a nod to Lucid's Silicon Valley heritage, and the software interface in the early cars is still in development. Otherwise, the luxury Ford performance, doors, driving range, and overall snazziness make it a credible challenger for high-priced EVs like the Porsche Taycan and the Mercedes-Benz EQS, as well as the Model Tesla S, or the Tesla Model S, whatever you think is the right way to say it. And now talking about the detail of its luxury interior and exterior. Make no mistake, the Air is intended to be a luxury car, and its handsome interior is fitted with rich-looking materials and cutting-edge technology. The sedan's spacious passenger capacity accentuated by its big back seat is very important of a feature to the Lucid. While the standard rear seats are considered to be comfortable for up to three adults, an optional executive rear seating option adds a reclining function for added comfort. The glass canopy of the Air makes it feel even more spacious, and it improves visibility. The front center of the console of the car appears to offer plenty of storage space behind the retractable lower touchscreen and inside the huge center console bin, which holds a set of cup holders as well as smartphone slots. 
There is another word that its front trunk, or <clears throat> frunk, will have a volume of 10 cubic feet. Furthermore, the Air has an advanced entertainment system that includes a huge higher touchscreen that flows out of the fully digital gauge cluster and tablet-like lower touchscreen that handles extra functions and can be retracted into the dashboard. The system's voice recognition software, according to Lucid, will respond to normal speech patterns. The interface also has an assistant that remembers the user's favorite music and climate settings. In addition to basic physical controls on the steering wheel, there are temperature and fan speed toggles, as well as a roller to alter the level of the audio system. Lucid Air also has a variety of driver assistance technologies, and the business is working on level 3 self-driving capabilities. The latter will not be available at first, but it is projected to be available within three years, thanks to the magic of over-the-air updates. So where do you rank Lucid Air in terms of your favorite luxurious EVs? Would you prefer the Rolls-Royce or the Lucid Air? Do let us know in that little comment box thingy. And the final one on our list today is none other than the Hongqi EHS9. Did you know that the Hongqi EHS9 is also called an electric Rolls-Royce from China? Nevertheless, no one expected a very high range result from the EHS9, because its large three-row SUV with brick aerodynamics and a weight of about 2,780 kilograms with the driver, but things turned out differently. As large battery of 99 kilowatt per hour and decent overall efficiency enabled it to achieve a relatively good result on par with other large BEVs like the BYD Tang, NIO ES8, or Audi e-tron 55. Furthermore, the Hongqi H9 appears to be a hybrid of the design characteristics of the top-spec luxury sedans that it competes with, such as the Rolls-Royce Ghost and the BMW 7 Series. The front grille with vertical slats is heavily influenced by Rolls-Royce products, and the thin two-port LED headlamps resemble those of the all-new version of the 7 Series. The sedan features a lot of chrome on the front grille, front and rear bumper inserts, and the lower half of the door panels, while the H9's dual-tone paint scheme is comparable to that of what Maybach offers. The tail lamps are identical to those of the Cadillac CT5 sedan. The Hongqi H9 feels like a true luxury sedan on the inside, with the majority of the cabin wrapped in gorgeous leather. Aside from satin, chrome, and piano black inlays, the H9 has one-of-a-kind trim made of wood, marble, and peppermint stick. The inside is also quite modern, with separate full TFT panels for the instrument panel and the touchscreen infotainment system in the center. The entire architecture of the interior, with the waterfall-like center console and circular theme for AC vents and dials for various functions, is reminiscent of the Mercedes-Benz E-Class cabin. Aside from these features, the Hongqi H9 includes a refrigerator, massage seats, and rear entertainment displays, which are often found in top-tier luxury saloons. The rear seats additionally include a center armrest, which controls for both front and rear seat adjustments. The panel between the front seats that faces the rear passengers has rear AC vents as well as a separate touch-sensitive climate control panel. Aren't these features enough to make it better than the Rolls-Royce when compared in terms of price? But still, Rolls-Royce is Rolls-Royce, isn't it? And that's the end of the video, but still, if you guys have any questions about anything related to any of these three luxurious EVs, then you can also ask in that comment box, whatever it's called. We believe the content was entertaining, and if it was that way, then yeah, like it and subscribe and stuff for more content like this. I worded that like a native English speaker. Yay! Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.